All right, good Tuesday morning, everybody. Yesterday was a pretty quiet or a pretty active day for us with light rain and snow kind of on and off throughout the day. Today is going to be a quiet day for us here in mid Michigan, starting off looking outside the studio here. We do have cloudy skies at the moment. We're going to see that cloud cover kind of dwindle as move throughout the day. Our temperature right now pretty well above average. We are at 34 degrees. Our average lows should be around 20 right now. And you can see starting the day off about 15 degrees above that 34 in Lansing. 36 in Jackson, 35 in Mason, Hillsdale, and then 36 in Marshall and Coldwater right now. Now our forecast for today, temperatures staying fairly steady in the upper 30s, partly sunny skies and our winds start from the northwest do transition to the south late in the day with them with gusts approaching 20 miles per hour. Now the satellite and the radar right now, the satellite is picking up on the cloud cover across mid Michigan, but notice to the north, we're starting to see some breaks in that cloud cover and that's going to kind of be the trend again as we do move throughout the day. Now, as I zoom out, you can see our setup. We do have an area of high pressure settled southwest of the state right now with this staying in close proximity to us today. That's going to be the reason we see a pretty quiet day and partly sunny skies. We're at least going to stay dry and it's going to be short lived though because this area of low pressure out to the northwest that is coming this way and that is going to bring a big change as we head into the holidays. Now, like taking a look at where this low pressure tracks, you can see it moving along the international border. This is tomorrow at 4 p.m. Ahead of this cold front, we will see strong winds out of the south pumping very warm air and tomorrow's temperatures getting up towards 50 degrees. But that cold front, this strong front does move through late tomorrow. With that, we are going to see rain showers along its passage and behind that, much colder air starts to spill into the state. So the rain turns to snow and then that cold air gusty winds to bring in that over Lake Michigan, which has warm, uh, warmer waters right now. That's going to start this lake effect snow machine. So we're going to see on and off snow showers, I think pretty much throughout Christmas Eve, and that'll stick with us on Christmas as well. And temperatures just continuing to fall through the day Thursday. And as Christmas is going to be a very cold day for us. Now taking a look at our forecast here in mid Michigan future track here again for today, a pretty quiet day. We're going to see a mix of sun and clouds. I think more in the way of sunshine through the late morning afternoon temperatures getting into the upper 30s winds staying out of the west northwest, but eventually by the late afternoon evening hours, those winds shift to the south. That's going to start to pump in that warmer air. So temperatures tonight tonight they do dip initially, but for the second half of the night, they're actually going to climb. So tomorrow morning we're going to see our temperatures starting off in the upper 30s. Winds are going to be very gusty tomorrow. Winds gusting towards 30 miles per hour, perhaps some stronger gusts out there as well. Now moving throughout the day, you can see our cloud cover thickening back up pretty quickly here. That cloud deck does thicken and lower and look at the temperatures closing in on 50 degrees. Rain showers move in by the late evening hours. Some of these could be on the heavier side behind this. This is when temperatures just start to plunge. You see them getting down into the 30s. That rain turns to snow and I kind of expect the map to look like this as we move throughout the day on Thursday and Friday as well. Temperatures Thursday starting in the upper 20s, but by the evening hours, we're going to be in the low 20s and continuing to fall into Christmas. Christmas morning, the temperature starting off in the teens. That's going to feel more like the single digits, perhaps around zero degrees as well. Some snow showers throughout Christmas as well. We dry out by Saturday, partly sunny, and then some more snow does arrive just in time for Sunday and Monday.